हेलो डियर ऑल वेलकम टू संडे एजुकेशन अकेडमी आई एम संतोष वाघ इन दिस वीडियो वी विल सी क्वेश्चन अंडर ट्राई दिस सेक्शन पेज नंबर 170 चैप्टर मेंसुरेशन क्लास 8 मैथमेटिक्स हियर वी विल जस्ट रिवाइज हाउ टू कैलकुलेट द एरिया ऑफ रेक्टेंगल ट्रायंगल एंड हाफ सर्कल सो लेट्स स्टार्ट आवर वीडियो सी द क्वेश्चन अंडर ट्राई दिस सेक्शन पेज नंबर 170 चैप्टर मेंसुरेशन क्वेश्चन इज गिवन मैच द फॉलोइंग फिगर्स विद देयर रिस्पेक्टिव एरियाज इन द बॉक्स मींस दिस फिगर्स आर देयर एंड इन द बॉक्स द एरिया इज गिवन वी हैव टू मैच दिस मींस व्हाट इज अस कैलकुलेट द एरिया ऑफ इज दिस फिगर नाउ फर्स्ट सी व्हिच आर दिस फिगर्स फर्स्ट फिगर इज पैरेललोग्राम सो आई विल राइट हियर इट इज पैरेललोग्राम सो व्हाट इज द फार्मूला for the area of parallelogram a is equal to for this parallelogram a is b into h b into h where b is the base and h is the height in parallelogram we know two opposite sides are parallel so this side this side and this side these two sides are parallel and there is a perpendicular distance between two parallel side that is a height h so if we know these two figures we can calculate the area of this parallelogram so this is the formula b is here 14 cm so i will write here 14 and height is 7 cm height is 7 cm if we take the multiplication we will get 14 into 7 that is 98 and unit will be cm square because unit for this length is cm cm into cm will be cm square so this a i will write here a1 for this figure a1 equal to 98 cm square means area of parallelogram is 98 cm square and here is a 98 cm square so this will be the our first answer then for second for second this figure is complete half circle why complete half circle because diameter is given 14 cm and this height is also given that is 7 cm means this is a half of this diameter is radius half of this 14 is 7 cm and this 7 cm is a height means this is also a radius so this is a complete half circle it is not a incomplete it is a complete half circle now area of this this is a half circle half circle so area of circle area of circle is pi r square pi r square this is the area of circle are you getting but it is a half circle so area of this figure this figure will be 1 by 2 means half of this pi r square now write the values put the values of this we know value of pi is 22 upon 7 and value of r here diameter is 14 cm so radius is 7 cm r square means 7 into 7 instead of writing 7 square i will write here 7 into 7 so because it is easy for calculation now cancel this 7 this 7 and this 7 will get cancel then this 2 2 ones are 2 and 2 11 ones are 22 so what are the remaining figures 11 into 7 this 11 and this 7 because this 7 is cancelled so multiplication of this 11 into 7 that will be the 77 and unit will be centimeter is unit here so unit will be centimeter square for area always unit is centimeter square because here we are multiplying two centimeter figures unit will be centimeter square and here is 20, 77 uh, centimeter square is this option now in the third figure it is a triangle so area for triangle we know this will be the a2 and area for triangle a3 this a3 figure 1 by 2 into b into h now what is b b is base here base is given 14 cm and height h this perpendicular distance between this opposite vertical opposite vertex and the base if we take the perpendicular distance that is minimum distance between vertex and the opposite side 
that is perpendicular that is given 7 cm so put this value base is 14 and h is 7 both are in centimeter then 2 on the 2 2 7 the 14 so 7 into 7 we will get 49 and unit will be centimeter square because base unit is centimeter height unit is also centimeter so centimeter into centimeter becomes centimeter square so 49 centimeter square so how we we can match we can match parallelogram area is 98 centimeter square then half circle area is 77 centimeter square and triangle area is 49 centimeter square now see the b part write the perimeter of each shape here also this question is also under try this section page number 170 chapter mensuration in b part a rectangle is given and here square is given why square because both sides are all sides are equal and here why rectangle because one side is 14 centimeter and another side is 7 centimeter so we need to calculate perimeter perimeter formula we know perimeter for this rectangle this is a rectangle so perimeter will be perimeter of rectangle is equal to 2 into bracket a plus b now see what is a and what is b a is this length and b is this length so put these values very simple a is 14 centimeter and b is 7 centimeter take the addition of 14 plus 7 that is 21 and 21 into 2 that is 42 42 centimeter is perimeter of this rectangle means perimeter of this figure and this is a square second figure is square so perimeter of square is addition see here what is perimeter perimeter is addition of all sides here all sides are 7 centimeter means 4 into a this is a formula 4 sides into a, a is a single side so write a is 7 centimeter so it will be 28 and unit will be centimeter unit will be centimeter now you can see even though it is 14 centimeter long and width is same but perimeter of square this square and perimeter of this rectangle perimeter of rectangle is not double this square why is not double because in perimeter we are, we are calculating all the sides if even though it is double see this is the center means there is one square and this one square 7 cm and this another square 7 cm square but for perimeter here we are not taking the measure of this center line that's why we are not getting the double of this square so, so perimeter of this rectangle is 42 cm and perimeter of square is 28 cm this is all for this video we will meet again in our next video do learn do enjoy thank you